fun as fuck. Oh no. When I walk up in the function, all Welcome my corners dead. When we oh. talk too much, then it's off with his head. Very he hate you know me, really, he gets me some bread. I feel like bone crusher, nigga. I ain't so Yo, when I walk up in the function, I'm a fucking dead. Only talk too much, then it's off with his head. Early heavy, man, you really, he just needs some bread. I feel like bone crusher, nigga, I ain't got a scare. When I walk up in the function, I'm a fucking dead. Only talk too much, then it's off with his head. Early heavy, man, you really, he just needs some bread. I feel like bone crusher, nigga, I ain't got a scare. When I walk up in the function, I'm a fucking dead. And I guess at some point in time, he's gonna jump in, he's gonna jump. I don't know, this is what he's gonna do. I'm just recording this shit, guys. If you just think it's serious. I need to move to Florida because all the fine niggas is here. It's mad fine. I done seen mad fine ass niggas since I've been here. You feel me? And I literally been here for what, an hour and a half? Two hours at the most? I done seen mad fine ass niggas. He cute too. He ain't my type though, but he cute. Yeah, 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 yeah. My ass out. Look, my ass out. Look, look, my ass is out. I'm twitching. You feel me? Bitch, I'm from OT. I don't even live here. I don't even live here, bitch. You best believe I'm acting like I'm from out of town. Yeah. In real life. Look at me. Ooh. Ooh. Look at this. Look. 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 You see it? Stop playing with me. You see that ass. I look real good tonight. Ew. <sighs> Shit. But yeah, I came back in my car so I could hit my blunt. I mean, hit the lettuce. And hit the, yeah. Because in real life, he's not coming on anytime soon. So... But I'm gonna hop off of here and I'm gonna hop off. I'm gonna go on Bigo. If you guys, I'm just gonna hop. I'm just hopping. I'm just hopping on lives. I'm just giving each and every platform a piece of my night. And yeah. But no, I'm, you know what? I started this. I'm gonna finish it with you guys. I'm just gonna sit here. And we're gonna get. Oh, oh shit now. Hey now. We're gonna get lit real quick. This is our 2.5. 
Then I'm gonna hop off and I'm gonna hop on the other one. That's what we're gonna do. We're gonna go live from live from live from live. I'm just learning. I'm learning. I'm just trying to maximize. This is something I enjoy doing. I enjoy going on live. I enjoy like sharing parts of my life with you guys. I enjoy being when I'm on live. I feel so much of a free spirit. It like it's, it's, it challenges me and makes me tap in at the same time. You know, it's like I think about stuff in my head and sometimes I just act on it and I talk about it. And sometimes I don't. And sometimes, you know, it's a, like I said, it's a challenge sometimes being on live, but I like it. I enjoy pressure. I've been pushing P since pushing P was a thing to push. You feel me? I've always put mad pressure on myself. So I like I like going live, you know? And I can't fake it. I don't have to edit it. I don't have to... If, I, if I'm if i talking to y'all right now and I fucking fart, I'm going to fucking fart. You feel me? I can't make that shit up. But either way, make sure you guys are tapping in with me. Um, I'm going to link everything and everything, whatever. I'm just trying to spread myself thin. I'm just trying to be the best I can be. I'm trying to maximize. I'm trying to tap in. I'm trying to use my gifts. I'm trying to tap in. I got angels watching with me. I got angels guarding me, so I know there's nothing I can do wrong. I, I'm taking all risk. I'm going stupid. I'm tapping in to, to mad shit right now. And I got, a, you know, I got a, I got a. I got a, yeah, it's a lot going on in my head and it's all good and it's all positive and I'm just happy for it. But I'm going I'm to stay on here for 10 minutes and then I'm going to hop off and I'm going to hop on the other one. But that's what I'm going to do. I'm just going to keep shit in rotation. If you really want to keep up with everything, you like, oh, I'm only getting pieces, bits and pieces. You're going to have to tap in on everything because that's what I'm going to do now. I'm just going to leave you motherfuckers teasers. Anything that I've already did and I already, you know, whatever, edited and shit like that, I'm going to keep it YouTube for YouTube and this for that and ah uh, you just gonna have to tap in if you fuck with me you really fuck with me you're gonna put the puzzle pieces together and you just gonna yeah you're gonna fuck with me on everything but either way this pay-per-view ho what did i tell y'all i done told y'all this in other videos mad long ago pay-per-view y'all better appreciate it while it's free because the price going up the price don't went up and it's okay and it's okay and it's okay but I think y'all can appreciate that because y'all don't see me come a long way. We don't been we OGs to this shit. If you here, if you here with me and you rock with me from YouTube, you've been fucking with me since 28, 2018. You feel me? It's 2022, 18, 19, 22, 22. Four fucking years, you feel me? So if you rocking with me from YouTube, I appreciate you. You feel me? I don't know what other platform I'd have brought you here, but if you rock with me for YouTube, I appreciate you. Y'all done seen some shit that motherfuckers don't know about. You feel me? And I appreciate y'all for that. I appreciate y'all for giving a fuck enough to even tap in and tune in. You feel me? I really appreciate that. It means a lot to me. You feel me? A lot of times I be feeling alone. A lot of time I be feeling scared. A lot of time I be feeling, I be feeling a bunch of shit, but I'm really trying to tap into a different energy and shit like that. And that's, that's what it's about. I'm really tapped into this other energy. I'm doing other things. I'm trying. I'm, I'm taking risk. I'm, I'm going out on the limb. And it, it's something I haven't felt for a long time. You feel me? And I love it. I love it here. I love it. So, yeah. I'm in Florida right now. I'm in Florida. And I'm here to see Rob Banks. I love him. <laughs> I mean, I don't really, like, I mean, whatever. I'm. A, he's just, he, oh, he just does something to me. You understand? I love Florida boys. He got the dreads and he just, mm, and he just, mm, and he's like, mm. I just don't know what it is about these niggas that do the music. Like, the first thing I ever fucked with, the nigga I lost my virginity to. Period. But I love fine ass bitch. Look at these. God damn. Look at. What the fuck? Look at all that ass. God. I love, bruh. I, I'm not. I, I don't. I don't deal with, with. with I don't tap in with the same gender no more. I don't do that. But I'm, I admire a woman when she's pretty and she's done. Oh my God. Women's. 
their beauty from their how they look their bodies everything is just oh my woman is beautiful i'll never i'll never you'll never catch me being no hating ass bitch because the bitch is too pretty i'm gonna tell the bitch she pretty and i'm gonna make other people i'm be like god damn bitch you fine as fuck like shit you lucky man if this wasn't a few years ago bitch i would yeah i'll be talking my shit people be like stop why the fuck i'm gonna let you know bitch you looking real edible but anyway i'm gonna hop off of here i'm about to hop on the other one i appreciate y'all tap it with me tap it with my links whatever y'all know like i love going live i love you know tuning y'all into my shit I know a lot of y'all probably don't tune into the lives because I be going lives random times. And because at this point, in this video, it's February 11th. And now it's the 12th because it's after midnight. Oh, no, it's not. I don't know if it's after midnight, but it's February 11th, 2022. My shit ain't popping right now. And it's okay because it's going to pop one day. And by the time y'all see this, it, you know, it is what it is. But. I'm going to put my shit out, you feel me? I'm going to get my shit out there. I'm going to see how I feel. I'm going to say what I think. And I'm just going to be real and authentic. And I'm going to be me. That's been what I've been doing. And then, like, some people might get annoyed. I personally don't give a fuck. And that's what my nigga, my nigga stood for. My friend. Uh, my, that was my friend. First and foremost, my friend. I just really wish he was here because we would really be running the social media shit up together because, bruh, it was like tit for tat. Like, we really could do this shit, bruh. It was it. Niggas was already really on it. That's why I just really get mad. But then I get motivated at the same time doing this shit, going live and shit like that. This is what my nigga did. This is something I've been, I've been doing. And my nigga was already doing this too. You feel me? So it's just like, he not here no more. So I don't got no choice. I gotta go hard. I gotta go hard. I gotta go hard. We didn't even get the opportunity to do this shit together. We both was already doing this and we never even had the opportunity to do it together. You feel me? We already was doing the social media shit. We never even got a chance to get it, do it together. Cause bruh, it's like, as soon as we met, as soon as it ended. That shit is sick, bro. That shit fuck with my head every day. You know, I look, and I don't know why, the other day it popped up. I met this nigga on a Monday. I lost him on a Monday. Isn't that sick? I met him on a Monday. Four months later, I lost him on a Monday. That's sick. Fucked up my head, bro. I'm like, wait, hold on. That shit weird as a bitch. But I try not to think into that too much, bro. I'm telling you every day I'm going through a mental battle. It's not a day. It's not a day. I don't give a fuck if I talk about this thing every day or not. I'm just in my feelings. I'm in my emotions. I'm under the influence. I'm being real. You feel me? It's not a day that goes by that I do not think about this man. It's not a day that goes by. Look, oh, I put it. I put it in a hotel. I I travel. I got his picture with me still. I don't got it tatted yet. I don't got shit. You feel me? I'm bringing my nigga with me, bruh. He gotta be with me, bruh. It don't feel right. You just don't meet people like that, and they just it just don't sit right with me. You feel me? I'm dreaming about this nigga. I haven't filled y'all in in a lot of shit because whatever, but. Whatever, I'm just gonna rant right now. I'm dreaming about this nigga. And then I gotta wake up and like do something gracious, do something with Sita, whatever, alarm going off, something, whatever. But I'm telling him I'm trying to go back to sleep so I can hop back in that dream because I'm not, I haven't dreamed about him a lot, you feel me? But what I'm dreaming about him, I, I can say it's been like three times. Down and dream about, and it's been like most recently, like the past two months, and it's like I'm, 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 I'm like begging him to come with me. I'm begging him to come home. I'm saying like, come here, you know. I don't know. My head just been everywhere with this shit, but it's not a day I don't go that goes by. I don't think about this nigga, and I don't think that's fair. But the only thing I can tell myself is 
I met him for a reason. You know, it was a certain type of motivation. It was a, a certain type of energy. It was a certain type of something behind this nigga. That I met him for a reason and I feel it. So I feel it's necessary for me to tap in more and go hard more because this was the plan anyway. This is what we was going to do anyway. Like I said, I only had him for four months. I met this nigga and lost this nigga in four months. So think about a regular relationship, how much shit you go through in four months. You feel me? But we went through mad shit. I don't went to jail. He don't went to jail. Niggas was homeless. Niggas was living at somebody else's house. Brought, niggas went through mad shit in four months. You feel me? Together. Together. Fucking with other people. Still fucking with each other. Mad shit, bruh. We went through mad shit in four months. And when we finally got to a good point, it's like the bullshit happened. I can literally... I don't even want to get into that, bruh. Either way, it's not a day that goes by I don't think about this thing. And I don't know why I don't know why God put me put him in my life and put him on my heart, you feel me? But obviously for a reason. Obviously I needed this motivation I got right now. I'm the type of person that learns through pain. So maybe I needed to learn and love and hurt so I could become whatever bitch. Either way, it sucks. I would rather much have this nigga here with me. You know? I would just much rather have this nigga here. She's whack as a bitch, but... I guess it is what it is. We got to like suck this shit up. We can't do nothing about it. <sighs> but anyway. Yeah. And I'm literally two hours away from where <laughs> Two hours away from Orlando, right? I ain't pulled up. I ain't, I ain't pulled up to this nigga grave since I since the last time I went live on this bitch about him, which was October, October, November, December, January, February. It's been four months. <laughs> it's been four months, bro. <sighs> I'm telling myself if it was the other way around Marquise would pull up on me you feel me two hours I'm about to pull up and go see her you feel me in a grave or not so like I'm mentally battling I really want to go but like I don't like I don't fucking know. My head is so fucked up behind this shit. Last time I pulled up, I literally sat there for like eight hours, bro. <laughs> this shit's not fair. <laughs> this is not fair. I shouldn't even be sitting here crying right now. Look, read on it. I, it said I didn't have to. Look at it. Read it. See, God sent you a distraction. I'm just going to chill. It said free, right? Free. Okay. Okay. I'm, I'm done crying now. I got to get off of here. I'm done crying now. I'm done crying. Stop crying, Asia. Oh, I already hit my blood. Let me hit it again. 
I had one of my, my, my friends from high school, right? Okay, y'all know Tara. Tara. Okay, okay, let's rewind it. Brett is a friend from high school. He is a friend because he ran on the same team that my boyfriend did. And he also, my high school boyfriend, uh, whatever. So I know Brett. Brett and Tara are friends because they went to the same college, whatever. Da, 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 da. So we was chilling and talking. I mean, not chilling and talking, but niggas was on FaceTime for like 2.5 seconds, whatever. And Brett was saying some shit like, you be on live crying and shit. Yeah. And then that made me think like, I low-key got embarrassed for like 2.5 seconds. And then I was thinking like, I'd rather be known for being on live crying, keeping it real about my shit. And the shit that I'm going through, vice versa, faking, acting like shit is cool. And I'm really fucked. You know, I'm really fucked up. Like, for the most part, it's a lot of videos on my channel that I have edited that I've never even posted. It's, a, it's like at least, like, I feel like 50 videos. On top of, like I said, and I said, I done said this in so many fucking videos over the years. I started recording shit as soon as I my water broke with Sita, you feel me? I had no idea anything was going to be left. I had no idea about no cert. I had no idea. It's just something was weighing on me. I wanted to do YouTube because I started taking business classes at MCC. And we had to come up with some class thing about a business. And I knew and I learned from my baby dad that YouTube make you money. So I was I made my 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 class business project around the YouTube shit. And then the more I'm learning about it, I'm like, maybe I should make a YouTube. And then I'm looking at other people's shit and I'm like, man, ain't nobody really talking about no real shit. Ain't nobody blah blah blah. I had just had a baby. I'm lo- I'm I'm by myself. I'm in an abusive relationship. I'm going through my pregnancy by myself. I got core involved i got mad extra shit going on you feel me mad shit but more than i'm I'm just really going through a fucked up time you feel me and on top of that boom i get pregnant again i get pregnant again so in the midst of me being pregnant i take these classes and da 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 i'm like damn my bet my first baby not even a year old yet but i'm pregnant again you feel me now my baby done turn one years old. Three weeks later, I'm having another baby. You feel me? I'm having both babies in the hospital. While I just pushed out a baby, I got both babies in the hospital. You feel me? Because nobody can watch them. <laughs> nobody can watch the other baby. You feel me? So I got both of them in the hospital with me type shit. You feel me? It's literally just been us three from the jump. You feel me? And that's where my mind be fucked up behind a bunch of shit. Like, being being a single parent is so fucking hard, you understand? That shit is hard. Sometimes it make you, bruh, the thoughts that I be thinking and the shit that I, I be, bruh, it's so hard being a single parent, bruh, and not having a solid support system. I could just sit here and talk to y'all about my fucking thoughts and emotions. Just think about it. I got gracious and Sita. And Sita got additional needs, you feel me? That a lot of people don't want to fuck with, you feel me? And when shit go left with her, or when sometimes she real aggy, or sometimes she da da da, it don't just be, it be like three kids in one. So I be like, something, bruh, you know, all by myself every day for years. It's been four years. Sita about to be four. You feel me? Some days I be feeling mad defeated. You feel me? It's been every day for four years. And then, like, I move. I meet somebody. I really care about them. I really love them. I think it's about to be this. We go through our shit. Then this nigga get killed. I'm like, what the fuck? (laughs) I'm like, what the fuck is going on, bruh? What is going on? What is going on? What the fuck is really good? 
But I'm about to go inside here, bro. I got to get off here. I'm about to get off here. Tap in.